नमस्कार मैं डॉक्टर पल्लवी प्रसाद आप सबका स्वागत करती हूँ ब्रेन वाइज भी डॉक्टर पल्लवी प्रसाद में फिर से आज हमारे साथ यहाँ पे बैठे हैं एस्टीम पर्सनैलिटी डॉक्टर परवेज ग्रैंड सर चीफ कार्डियोलॉजिस्ट चेयरमैन एंड मैनेजिंग ट्रस्टी ग्रैंड मेडिकल फाउंडेशन रूबी हॉल क्लिनिक पुणे आप सबका स्वागत करती हूँ सर मैं गुड आफ्टरनून पल्लवी गुड आफ्टरनून सर गुड आफ्टरनून सो सर मुझे पहला सवाल आपसे ये पूछना है कि आपने न्यू न्यू टेक्नोलॉजीज अपने रूबी हॉल में लाई है तो आपका न्यू टेक्नोलॉजीज के बारे में और रोबोटिक जो इंडस्ट्री अपनी आ रही है इंडिया में उसके बारे में आप कुछ बताए पल्लवी क्या हुआ है मेडिसिन में बहुत चेंजेस हो गया है वी आर नॉट द सेम डॉक्टर दैट वी वर फोर्टी ईयर्स अगो पहले हम लोग खाली स्टेथोस्कोप करके फिर रहे थे हाँ. अभी वो दिन गया है वी हैव नाउ बिकम वेरी इंस्ट्रूमेंटल दैट मीन्स आपको हार्ट का प्रॉब्लम हो जाएगा तो आप डायरेक्ट कार्डियोलॉजिस्ट के पास जाएगा हाँ. आपका पेट दुख रहा है तो यू विल गो डायरेक्टली टू गैस्ट्रोलॉजिस्ट आपको आंख दुख रहा है तो आप आई डॉक्टर के पास जाएंगे सो टाइम्स हैव चेंज्ड अभी 40 बरस पहले क्या होता था आपको थोड़ा छाती में दुखता था सो यू यूज टू गो एंड सी योर जी पी एंड जी पी वुड ट्राई टू गिव यू सम ट्रीटमेंट एंड देन फाइनली यू वुड लैंड अप विद अ कार्डियोलॉजिस्ट बट नाउ वट इज हैपन सिंस टेक्नोलॉजी हैज चेंज सो मच वी आर फाइंडिंग दैट अनलेस यू हैव इक्विपमेंट बेस टूडे you are going to be nowhere in medicine so you must have simple things like ecg echoes mris ultrasound simple things but a hospital like ruby hall clinic which is i think one of the best hospitals in india today we are possibly within the top 10 cannot only rely on echo we have to go more humko zyada karna padta hai we have to go robotic we have to go angiography and your plasty and various other modalities which are not available in uh, other hospitals hospitals now are very competitive competition both the hospitals ke beech mein so to keep up with competition you have to have the best equipment that is available anywhere in the world ruby hall ki success hai ruby hall success hai because any equipment jo bhi naya equipment aata hai anywhere duniya mein world mein पहले रूबियल को आता है वी हैड द फर्स्ट एम आर आई द फर्स्ट सी टी स्कैन द फर्स्ट कैथ लैब द फर्स्ट आई सी यू द फर्स्ट मशीन फॉर कैंसर ट्रीटमेंट द फर्स्ट इन रोबोटिक सर्जरी एंड सो ऑन एंड सो फॉर इसके लिए वी हैव कैप्ट अप आवर लीड इन मेडिसिन सो बिकॉज कॉम्पिटिशन इज सो टफ एंड सीवियर वी हैव टू इनोवेट हमारा नॉर्मल मशीन जो रहता है हम खरीदते हैं वो छह बरस में ऑप्सिलेट हो जाता है तो हर छह बरस हमको वो नया इक्विपमेंट लाना पड़ता है जस्ट टू कीप अप विद द टेक्नोलॉजी और आजकल जो इक्विपमेंट आता है वो सस्ता नहीं आता है अभी आप एक अच्छा लीनियर एक्सलरेटर लिया कैंसर ट्रीटमेंट के लिए वो ट्वेंटी टू का आता है नियरली बीस क्रॉर का आता है अभी हमने एक मशीन लिया है साइबर नाइफ करके बहुत महंगा है इट इज नियरली फोर्टी फाइव क्रॉस नियरली पचास क्रॉर का मशीन आता है फॉर ट्रीटमेंट ऑफ स्पेशलाइज कैंसर नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वही था कि साइबर लाइफ के लिए कौन से पेशेंट रिकमेंडेड है और कौन से नहीं है और उसका क्या थोड़ा सा कैलिब्रेशन अभी मैं साइबर लाइफ के बारे में मैं बता सकता है थोड़ा सा क्या होता है आपको कैंसर हुआ है हाँ. तो आपको तीन प्रकार का ट्रीटमेंट होता है वन इज मेडिकल ट्रीटमेंट वन इज केमोथेरेपी one is radiation and last is surgery so yes. there are four five different four, five. types of treatment abhi as far as uh, radiation is concerned that means we are giving radioactive stuff to the patient to destroy the cancer the normal machine is called linear accelerator hamare paas abhi do linear accelerator hai hum ye linear accelerator upar din mein 200 patient karte hain but kya hota hai some patients where the cancer is very focal that means uh ekdam specific rehta hai for example aapko kaan mein cancer reh sakta hai uska acoustic neuroma ha uh-huh. now that is a focal tumor wo aap linear accelerator mein karega to wo tissues around it can also be damaged uh-huh. in the brain uh-huh. so what this uh, cyber knife does it only hits the tumor and does not allow the tissues around it to get destroyed so it is a huge advantage 
Now already in the first month we have done 25 patients, out of which two patients are free. Because I have done what I have children hai below the age of 17, 18, I give them free treatment. Deta hai. They, we do not charge them. This is part of the donation that we got. So we are sticking to that. So there are other conditions like uh, if you have got a tumor rega. Now a tumor chota rega. Then we can hit the cyber knife using it and destroy that tumor without damaging the eye. So that the eye is not damaged. So this is another breakthrough. Then there are other indications like trigeminal neuralgia, where on the side of the neck uh, face mm -hmm. you get severe pain. A lot of people are suffering for many years. Uh, with this new machine, you just have to hit it for 20 minutes on the trigeminal nerve, destroys the trigeminal nerve, and the patient is cured. It's for soft tissue. Soft tissues, yeah. Now the cyber knife works on the principle of AR. So what happens is they have got a multiple cases which has been fed into the AR application and the cyber knife will then pinpoint what is the best way of treating this particular case so that it only destroys the focal tumor. So this is a very, very big breakthrough in uh, medicine and in treatment of cancer. How many cycles will be required for one patient? Normally most people require one or two cycles. Some people one, two, very rarely three cycles. And each cycle is about uh, 20 minutes, that's all. There are no side effects side with effects. cyber knife. You take the treatment and you walk home. Okay. So it's a very uh, breakthrough in uh, medicine technology and uh, there are only two machines in the whole of India. Uh, one is in Chennai and the other is in uh, Ruby Hall, yes. Pune. That's why the cost is very expensive. But uh, the results you'll see for yourself, fantastic results, fantastic treatment and all these people hopefully get cured. So that is as but far as... It is completely free of charge. All children, all children are to be treated free of charge on the cyber knife because normally the treatment costs between 4 to 5 lakhs. Char se leke 5 lakh lagta hai treatment cost but bache log ke liye hum sab ko free kar rahe. See, Ruby Hall has been doing angiography and angioplasty for the last 42 years. The yes. first case of uh, angioplasty in India was done at Ruby Hall where I conducted the workshop. That was done in 1987. Since then, we have done nearly 3 lakh angiographies and approximately 1 lakh angioplasties. So every day we do about eight to nine angioplasty. So angiography means taking photographs of the heart and angioplasty means opening the blockage using a balloon and then putting in a stent. So this procedure normally takes between 15 minutes to one to two hours depending on how many blockages are there and uh, blockages kidar hai, uske upar humko treatment dete hai. Now Ruby Hall at present has got four cat labs and we have got all the very high end cat labs. So what we are seeing is more and more patients are coming to Ruby Hall from Pune and surrounding areas of Maharashtra right up to Parbani that is 300-400 kilometers away. We also see very complicated cases because sometimes in the smaller labs you can get complications. And the advantage of the Ruby lab is that the resolution is so good that if there is a complication outside, the patient is sent here. And in most cases, we are able to solve the problem. The other big advantage of our cath labs is that the radiation is one third of what it is in a normal cath lab. So we have got these high end radiation cath labs where the radiation level is very low. So the patient doesn't get much radiation and the operator also doesn't get uh, so much radiation. So we have done workshops from Ruby Hall all over India and the world. We have done workshops to US, we have done workshops to America, uh, England, France, Germany and of course in India every week we do workshops from our cath labs where we give live cases to various centers and teaching programs. 
Ruby Hall is a teaching hospital. So we have got postgraduates coming from all over India to get taught in various specialties like MD, DM and so on. And they can get their degrees and qualifications at the Ruby Hall Clinic. We also have a very big uh, nursing school because nursing is one of the most important places as far as a hospital is concerned. Remember the hospital runs on doctors and nurses and of course as I said equipment now. So if you have good doctors, if you have good nurses and good equipment, you have got everything correct for you and that is the key to success. Abhi worldwide sub debate chal raha hai ki AI is good for uh, human being or not but uh, can you say ki this is a good thing for doctors? AI is very good for uh, all Maybe medical like equipment that are coming out now will be AI based. Yes, sir. Now uh, we have got, uh, we are doing of course CT scans, we have a CT scan. The CT scan we have is a 128 detector CT scan. But the new CT scan, I was uh, just talking to people from the US uh, yesterday only. The new CT scan can do a complete coronary CT in one second. And it is completely AI based. So it will give us fantastic pictures and it will also give us the high end quality uh, of the experience of AI with the other people who have uh, put AI into the system system of course a normal CT scan today you can buy for 45 lakhs or you can buy a CT scan for 2 crores or 4 crores but the new CT scan which is 680 uh, cycles per minute costs around 20 crores mm -hmm. so you can see the technology uh, 20 years ago it was one cycle and today it has become 640 cycles per minute so that just shows you how medicine is uh, moving forward. So it, this AI is a good thing for medical? AI is a huge breakthrough for medicine yes. and all equipment now that will be manufactured in 2023 onwards will be AI based. So if you are not getting AI then don't buy that equipment because it comes as part of the package now. So all companies Siemens, Philips, GE are all buying uh, AI equipment and making AI equipment uh, every, every day now. Sir, you are doing a hospital run and you are upgrading yourself every day 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 and you are technology into the staff also. Now we have got one full brand new building we have built only management building. It is 8 stories and 75,000 square feet. It only does management that means how to manage people, how to improve their way of working. For example I will give you in the management building we have put in a complete uh, what shall I say laboratory for uh, performing labs. But now what happens is we have got what is called as a shoot system. So blood is taken from a from a ward. It is put straight into the shoot system. Within 20 seconds it goes to the lab. The lab gets the sample and he starts the process. He puts the sample directly into the machine and he doesn't have to do anything. The result comes on the other side and the entire process is uh, no human beings are involved in it. Ismi kya hota hai abhi jo ward boy hota tha, he used to carry the samples, take it from a lab, from the ward directly to the lab. Usme beech mein chai ke le chale jata tha, to ek ghanta lagta tha sample jane ko ward se leke laboratory mein. Abhi ye do second mein ho jata hai. So this is the type of thing. We have also put lot of new systems. Recently we are very lucky that the metro has started in Pune. And uh, Ruby Hall has got its own metro station. So we have put a lift direct from the metro station directly to Ruby Hall. So you can come in directly. That has made a lot of difference. Now 20% of our staff are coming by metro. So that is opening up the roads of Pune to some extent because the traffic jam is terrible. But with the metro coming in and the metro started in Ruby Hall and the metro station, 
we are finding that uh, decongestion of our roads is also taking place and many of our staff which were not coming on time are now coming on time also to work. They are going back also on time. They are going back fast because they don't have to get into all this traffic jam that you used to see. So now as I told you, Bistaka patients and uh, uh, staff are coming by metro. I hope this goes to 50% shortly when the ex metro expands to other cities, which I find that shortly, I mean, and other, other places in Pune. I'm sure, I'm sure that shortly this will also take yes, place. Mm. Uh, one last question, I have to ask you, that the new doctors are so, how do you learn AI to learn AI? No, they don't have to learn AI to learn AI. So, since the machine comes with the AI, it is put into it. But now we are also expanding information technology, IT. We are shortly trying to make Ruby Hall completely paperless. So, there will be no writing, no nothing. Everything will be online, start to finish. Now, we are setting up an app. Yeah. Suppose a patient needs to come for a hernia operation. Mm -hmm. He goes on to the Ruby app and he puts all his details in. The app will tell him where to park his car. The app will tell him which room is available for him. He doesn't have to go to a reception. Okay. He goes straight on the app, types it in and he gets admitted. From getting admitted, the surgeon knows where he is, which ward he is. The surgeon will get a copy of the, this thing. The theatre bookings are also done on the app. So everything will be online now, shortly. It hasn't started, but that's where the future is and that's what we are looking at. So as I said, hospital management has changed a lot. It's gone from the days of writing things on paper. Everything will be online. Everything will be computerized. Everybody will know where they have to go at what time. Appointments for uh, OPDs will also be taken online. Drug will be disposable online, so the moment the prescription is given, the pharmacy will get a copy of that. He will prepare the drug, the patient has to just go pay and collect his prescription. So all these new things are coming in to uh, technology based and that is going to change the complete future of medicine and the future of hospitals. After all, what is a hospital? A hospital is like a hotel. It's a hotel with some 35 different branches. Like a hotel has got three restaurants. We have got 35 restaurants which we have to serve. So this is how the system seems to work and integrate into one another. And as I said, unless you follow these things and if you keep up with it, you will succeed. If you don't, the hospital will close down. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, sir. आज इतने टाइम दिया आपने और इतनी अच्छी इनफॉरमेशन हमें बताई उसके लिए बहुत-बहुत धन्यवाद. Thank you.